The state has released its final rules for the use of medical marijuana. Back in November, voters made Massachusetts the 18th state to legalize the drug for debilitating medical conditions. But as Bill Shields shows us, it could be months before the first dispensaries open up for business. Norwell is a quiet, leafy town full of historic homes. It has a timeless feel about it. But today, Norwell has jumped into the future, becoming one of the first in the state to allow medical marijuana dispensaries. Right, the zoning for the new medical marijuana is in our industrial zones. It also regulates it that it has to be at least 500 feet from a daycare or a school or a residential districts. The dispensaries will be sited in one of two industrial parks, not residential areas. Paul Amorosino runs a physical therapy business nearby and doesn't think he'll be affected. I'm pretty confident that the town of Norwell do a, a very good job regulating this uh, the service that's provided. Today, the State Public Health Council laid down some guidelines for the dispensaries. A 60-day supply would get the patient 10 ounces, and they have to have a debilitating condition. Anyone under 18 would have to have parental and a doctor's consent. And some financially strapped patients could grow their own. Have some doctor's permission for it, and I don't see any, any problem with it whatsoever. And again, marijuana will only be sold with a doctor's prescription. But few here in Norwell think the dispensaries will change the character of the town. They'll regulate and watch it, and the people that are going to need it are going to get it. So they'll put the dispensaries in one of two industrial parks like this one, and the town plans to regulate it heavily. So far, though, they haven't had any applicants, but it's still early. In Norwell, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.